Hallelujah. Hi, welcome in for the storm. Don't be scared. God protects us. Then he got into the boat and his disciples followed him. Suddenly, a furious storm came up on the lake so that the waves swept over the boat. But Jesus was sleeping. The disciples went and woke him saying, Lord, save us. We're going to drown. He replied, you of little faith, why are you so afraid? Then he got up and rebuked the winds and the waves, and it was completely calm. The men were amazed and asked, what kind of man is this? Even the winds and the waves obey him. Matthew 8 verses 23 to 27. But even if we don't feel at ease, God is greater than our feelings and he knows everything. 1 John 3 verse 20. Our Lord, you bless those who live right and you shield them with your kindness. Psalm 5 verse 12. Let's think. In this story, Jesus and his friends who were experienced fishermen were in deep water in the middle of the lake when a huge storm blew in. The wind and waves were crazy, rocking the boat and tossing lots of water inside. His friends were terrified, and it seemed Jesus had no idea what was going on. Jesus always knows what's going on. Have you had any scary experiences? How did he protect you? Let's do Think about a time when you were safe in God's arms. Share how God protects you. Beginning in Acts 27 through Acts 28 verse 10, you can read another really cool story about how God calmed the men facing a different storm. More mayhem followed, but God protected them and was glorified. They realized how amazing God is. Let's pray. God, help us remember that you're always there when we are in trouble. Thanks for calming and protecting us during those times. In Jesus' name, amen.